Hi everyone, it's Schematic Matt, and today we are going to talk about muscles of eye movement. There are six muscles involved in the control of the eyeball itself. They can be divided into two groups, the four recti muscles and the two oblique muscles. Recti muscles. There are four recti muscles. Superior rectus, inferior rectus, medial rectus and lateral rectus. These muscles characteristically originate from the common tendinous ring. This is a ring of fibrous tissue which surrounds the optic canal at the back of the orbit. First muscle is superior rectus muscle. This muscle originates from the superior part of the common tendinous ring and attaches to the superior and anterior aspect of the sclera. Main movement is elevation, also contributes to adduction and medial rotation of the eyeball. It is innervated by the oculomotor nerve. Next muscle is inferior rectus muscle. This muscle originates from the inferior part of the common tendinous ring and attaches to the inferior and anterior aspect of the sclera. Main movement is depression, also contributes to adduction and lateral rotation of the eyeball. It is innervated by the oculomotor nerve. Next muscle is medial rectus muscle. Here we are talking about the right eye. Medial rectus muscle originates from the medial part of the common tendinous ring and attaches to the anteromedial aspect of the sclera. This muscle adducts the eyeball. It is innervated by the oculomotor nerve. Now let's talk about lateral rectus muscle. This muscle originates from the lateral part of the common tendinous ring and attaches to the anterolateral aspect of the sclera. This muscle abducts the eyeball. It is innervated by the abducens nerve. Ok, now let's talk about oblique muscles. There are two oblique muscles, the superior and inferior obliques. Unlike the recti group of muscles, they do not originate from the common tendinous ring. From their origin, the oblique muscles take an angular approach to the eyeball. First oblique muscle is superior oblique muscle, which originates from the body of the sphenoid bone. Its tendon passes through a trochlea and then attaches to the sclera of the eye, posterior to the superior rectus. This muscle depresses, abducts and medially rotates the eyeball. It is innervated by the trochlear nerve. And last but not least, inferior oblique muscle. This muscle originates from the anterior aspect of the orbital floor, attaches to the sclera of the eye, posterior to the lateral rectus. This muscle elevates, abducts and laterally rotates the eyeball. It is innervated by the oculomotor nerve.